Well, good afternoon, folks. I just uh, thought I'd give you a quick video update. This is that uh, trout creel that I bought a while back from Amazon. And uh, over the weekend, I found this fly rod at a uh, local fishing shop there at Lake Eufaula. And the guy was kind enough to sell it to me for $5. I uh, knocked the bottom out of it. And... Uh, to my amazement, the uh, the all thread for the lamp fit perfectly through it. So the way it's going to wind up, I'm going to have th and th this particular um, all thread's a little too short, but uh, it's going to work just perfectly. I'll put that lamp socket there. This is going to go down through the middle of this uh, lid like so, not through that hole there, of course, but, and then I'll have the uh, fishing reel on there to operate the lamp, turning it off and on, and this is going to be the lamp for the, uh, the new nightstand that I'm making for our bedroom suit. So anyhow, I thought I'd uh, do a quick video. Um, there'll be uh, more little updates to this video as I as I get this thing together. So anyhow, I'm going to get off here and get ready for, uh, to go to work, and I will catch you a little bit later. Okay, folks, another quick update on this uh, trout lamp. I've got this put together. This is the. Uh, the inner workings, the uh, all thread, and I've got a uh, block of cedar that I'm going to use. And uh, how it'll work, I'm going to have to take that this lid off of it and uh, make a hole. This will sit down inside the basket like so, and I'll attach it. And then the fly rod, of course, will come down over the top, and it'll be just high enough outside the uh, basket and then the uh, the rest of the lamp parts and the uh, fly reel that I've got on order I found on eBay an old Shakespeare I'm going to use it and uh, it won't be long and this thing will be ready to go so anyhow I thought I'd share that with you real quick get these little projects out of the way and then I'm going to get back to work on the uh, nightstand so we'll catch you guys shortly folks another quick update on the lamp I've got everything down inside. As you can see, let's see if I can get that get that block of wood down in there. The cord will pass out of the. Well, let me get around here. Out of a small hole I cut into that. That. And uh, see if I can do this one-handed. This is the uh, fly rod. And that'll sit on top of that like so. All right, and then fly reel goes there. Just about ready. So I'll get some more done on it and bring you back. See you soon.
Good morning, folks. Saturday morning. Just got back from the hardware store. I was looking for some fishing line for this fly reel, and of course, living in Oklahoma. <laughs> yeah, they got it. Went to Academy, and they marked at they marked down all their fly fishing stuff, and. Uh, I was a day late and a dollar short, completely sold out. So what this is is some orange twine that I picked up at the hardware store. It looks like fly uh, fly line or fly fishing line or whatever they call it. You can tell I'm not a fly fisherman. But uh, it worked out good. It's uh, the larger diameter, so it'll, it'll pass. Of course, it's orange. And then uh, i got to get a nut for, for this because this is just drilled out and set on top. That's not going to be effective at all but, but uh, this is what I've come up with it works works really well just like the other did just give it a turn and there you go turn it back off so anyhow I still have a lampshade and I'm waiting on a bunch of flies to come in to, to put around that lampshade stuff so it's not quite finished but when I do get there I'll bring you back and let you have a look see you soon Okay, folks, so this, uh, this is it. This brings to a close the, uh, the little uh, fly rod uh, lamp build that I did. There's the, uh, the old, um, it's an old Shakespeare. Yeah, I forget the, uh, the brand name of that old fishing pole. And then, of course, I uh, put all these uh, flies on it. I didn't do the back side of the lamp, so that, you're not going to see it anyway. That's a lot of flies. What I have left over, I'm going to see if I can't catch any fish with them. So, anyhow, that's going to bring a close to uh, this particular video. And uh, I will catch you guys on the next one. Y'all have a great week.